now I'm going to come down to my picture and do a couple more adjustments. She has something on her arm here and I'm just going to, I'm going to come to the spot healing tool. If this was uh, too large or small I would hit my right or left bracket to make it the right size and I'm just going to leave it about right like this and zap that and if you need to you can do it a couple times. She also looks like she might have gotten into some colors or some magic markers and she has some marks on her hand and you could play with this and remove these. I'm going to come back here, spot healing brush and make it a little bit bigger and we can just remove these. You may have to undo this if it does something like this. Oh, edit, undo, or you can do control Z. You may need to make it smaller by hitting your left bracket here. Control Z, I don't like the way that looks. And you can just play with this. Maybe just dab it. Let's come back, view, fit on screen. I'm going to go ahead and put the 25 in here. It's easier to look at. And as you can see, this is how it looked before. And it even looked not this good because it had noise before we used the image nomic noise reduction. And this is what it looks like after. So again, you may walk away from it and come back and say, you know, it's too adjusted. And I, that's what I like to do. I like to walk away from the project for a little while and come back and see if I want to change anything. Sometimes when I have fresh eyes I can see maybe something else that I want to change. So I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you can work on some of your photos. Oh, let me show you one more thing. You can do this crop 5x7, 4x6. I'm going to have to crop this to an 8x10. I think it looks nice like this. and all done and I can send this to the printer and have it printed now. So I hope you enjoyed it and like I said have fun with your photos. Let me see what you've done. Have a great day.